hey you guys it's me morgan and i know my focus or not okay <clears throat> so i know i have not been uploading my um, fitness vlog <clears throat> because it's just been extra crazy because um my sister got married kaya um she's not my real sister but you know i look at her as a sister she got married and then it's into the school year and I've just been tired and I've been forgetting to bring my camera to the gym with me. So I have it today and today is Monday the 14th. So today marks officially four weeks until it's over and I had my ups and downs. So the last like week and a half I've been slacking. Like I cheated so bad last week. It was horrible. But um, I'm back on my grind because it's like the halfway mark and it's four weeks away um so i have to get my life together so i'm about to go to the gym and i am getting my pre-workout um basically it gives you energy before you work out so this is my pre-workout that i take i had like four different flavors but all i have left is green apple and grape now i love the pink lemonade one so, and I'm also gonna take my L-carnitine right here. So, so yeah, you guys, um, don't kill me, please, because I have been slacking the last two weeks. I didn't put a vlog up, but this will definitely be up, and I will not leave you guys hanging again, I promise. So, yeah, so I'm gonna get my pre-workout ready and then also i'm just like super excited because school gets out we have eight days left hallelujah so school's about to get out and i'll be able to work out twice a day so i'll be like really on the grind i can work out twice a day and uh, it'll be great so um I am going on vacations, but I'm not going on vacation until after the challenge. Like, I really wanted to go on vacation before the challenge was over. Because I was just trying to get the heck up out of America. And take a trip, but if I go on a trip before the challenge is over, I am likely to cheat. Especially if I go to, like the caribbean or somewhere like that i'm gonna want to cheat so i'm going to dominican republic at like three days after the challenge is over and then i'm going to thailand in july and la be in la also in july um and yeah so taking my l-carnitine i have pre-workout like all over my hand just so ignore that but I love it, it's lemon drop, it tastes so good. So, um, so yeah, I'm about to head to the gym. I'll let you guys see what I look like in the mirror. So this is what I'm looking like currently with this focus, so this is my stomach. So I wish I had like hips because it makes it look like I'm fat, but I'm really not fat. It's just I have no hips, so it's like, you know. But that's what I look like right now. I have not weighed myself. I'm not weighing myself until like Sunday because I can't. I just, I can't right now. I'm scared to get on the scale. I don't want to know what it says. So yeah, so I just wanted to give you guys that update while I could right now. So I'm about to go and head to the gym and get this workout. <laughs>
not working out. You're on the phone. You're on your phone. Really? Let me see how strong. Flex your finger. <laughs> it looks special. <laughs> officially going through it right now um yeah like I'm so hungry and hopefully this lighting's better okay I'm so so hungry it's ridiculous like I have not cheated nothing and I feel so carb deprived I am just like starving like I want to cry I went to Kroger to um I went to Kroger to get some more asparagus because I ran out and I walked past like ice cream and all this stuff and I was just like so depressed because I miss all of that so um, I tonight I'm not eating cod and asparagus I'm going to make like a burger so <coughs> I'm gonna be making a turkey burger and I have this turkey right here you guys know I usually use 99% lean but for the sake of making a burger, because the 99% lean one is a little difficult to make it to a burger, I'm just going to use this one. And um, there's this girl on Instagram named Follow the Lita, Lita Lewis. And she made, like, y'all, I love cheese. So she made, like, this cheese, egg, avocado sandwich, right? So I literally bought everything she had. So she got this cheese. I'm not supposed to eat dairy. So this is lactose dairy soy free cheese. So we're gonna see how this goes. This is vegan cheese. I found it in the vegan section at the store. So I'm gonna try this out. And I got this veganese mayonnaise. Oh, Jesus. And then for my bread, I'm not supposed to have bread. But I can have Ezekiel bread, and I used to eat this, so I don't know if you guys seen it before, but it's sprouted grain bread. 
Um, it looks like this, it's flowerless. So yeah, so this has um, 15 grams of carbs per slice. So I'm gonna use two, um, 0.5 fat, four grams of protein. So it's pretty good, okay? So the only thing with this is you have to keep it frozen. Sorry if you guys like see behind me. Um, so I took two pieces out just to like fall out and I'm gonna put it on the little grill thing. So I need to spray this. So I'm gonna put, I just got done cooking the asparagus. So I'm gonna put the turkey burger on here and Oh my God, these things rip apart so easily. I don't want to, what in the world? Look how fast that ripped apart. Like, look at that. I'm not even gonna use that one right now. Cause I want a pretty nice one. That is not gonna rip apart. Okay. It's so hard to cook with one hand. Okay. All right, so. I'm just gonna take this one and literally plop it on here. So I just plopped it on there. I'll season it in a second. Um, I guess I'll put this stuff in the refrigerator for now. And then, these people upstairs are so loud. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't have a toaster, so I'm just gonna put the bread onto there too. So let me go ahead and get that stuff situated and together, and then I'm gonna come back and show y'all what it looks like. Okay, okay. Okay, so I cooked the turkey burger. This is a cheese. I had to put it in the microwave because it, there was no way it was going to melt. So, um, yeah, so I'm just gonna put my avocado on here like this. This is half an avocado. I love avocado. So, I'm going to put half this avocado on here. And then I'm going to put a little bit of salt. Okay, and then I'm gonna take it, and I did put that veganese on here. I'm gonna mash it just like that. And I have my little burger thing. I'm gonna see if it tastes good. Okay, so it is pretty good. I'm about to put some more veganese on it because I didn't really put that much. So I didn't know what it was gonna taste like. So I'm about to put a little bit more of that on it. But overall, it's actually very tasty and it's gonna satisfy my craving I have right now. Like I am so carb deprived. So this Ezekiel bread, carbs in it, it's like a lifesaver right now. So I'm gonna eat that with some asparagus today. And this is not like a meal that I would eat every night. This is just like, cause I'm like about to cry cause I'm so hungry right now. So yeah, so, um, Y'all should definitely try that. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to make the same thing with the Ezekiel bread, because I eat oatmeal anyway for breakfast, so that's carbs. So I'm just gonna switch it out tomorrow, and instead of having oatmeal, have the Ezekiel bread with um, egg and avocado on it, and see how that turns out. So, yes, yes. I'm glad I found something new. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat my food so I can go to bed. Hey you guys, so I am headed to the gym right now. I'm almost there. Yeah, I'm so tired. Um, so I thought this week, today is Monday the 21st of May. So I thought this was like my third week until it's over, but this is really the fourth week. So I think the challenge ends on June. 16th so i have this week and then uh, half of next week is may and half is june so i have that week and then the following week and then the week after that is the last week so i think it ends on the 16th and i feel much better because i was kind of like freaking out because i was like 
oh my god you know it's halfway over and I need to get myself together um, this is definitely very hard to do I thought that I mean I knew it wasn't gonna be easy but it's definitely like a serious challenge like the hard part is not working out the hard part is eating you're eating so this is the last week of school also so we're having parties and pizza and stuff so I'm just gonna try my best not to eat it um, I started working out on Sundays also which like I used to work out on Sundays but like years ago but then I took a break because I feel like I was working out way too much so I started working out on Sundays now so I work out every day except for Friday but starting next week I'll be working out on Friday also because I'll be out of school out of work so I'll be more free um, and I'm extra excited because I can like do two a days once I get out this week so starting like the day after Memorial Day I will be doing two workouts a day um, I'll be going to LA Fitness and HX Fitness so just depending on the day and stuff like I'll decide which one I want to go to in the morning or which one I want to go to at night um, HX Fitness is like further away from my house so it's easier if I go there in the morning because there's like no traffic and y'all know Atlanta has like the worst traffic ever so and LA Fitness is closer to me so I'll be doing like two a days and really getting it in so I'm definitely like the last couple weeks about to see much more results as far as the scale um, I feel like I don't know I barely look at the scale because um, there's like never any parking here I don't look at the scale that much because um, my weight like always fluctuates and I um like I could be I'm trying to wait for this car to go by this person so my weight like if you look at me you can tell that I'm smaller but like it doesn't show on the scale so um when I started I was like 159 or something um I accidentally ate pasta salad yesterday because I went to my parents house after church and my mom makes like the best pasta salad ever and you know I'm not supposed to have carbs so I ate that and that was just like not good so I'm kind of scared to get on the scale so I'm gonna get on later after I work out but I'm about to do my little workout and get it in on this Monday um i will be doing videos every week i'm sorry you guys that i was behind a little bit um but yeah so that's about it i'm about to get in and i drink my pre-workout and now i'm about to go and work out hey you guys so i'm home from the gym now it's like what time is it 903 and i had a really good workout I um, did a whole bunch of cardio today, and oh my gosh, I'm getting this ugly thing on my forehead. But um, I did a lot of cardio today, which I really needed it. So, workout's really good. Oh, it's ringing. Um, my camera is about to die. I need to charge it. But I guess I will be back with more um, videos on this update. I will weigh myself next week. I do not even want to weigh myself right now because I'm scared. So I'll weigh myself next week. Um, yeah, it's almost time. It's almost time. Um, I'm gonna try really hard this week to not eat the pizza and cupcakes that I'm getting my kids um, for the end of the school year. Um, so yeah. Oh my God, I'm gonna show you these slides I got too. Like I love these, they're so cute. Like they looked weird, like just when they were you know on the shelf but I put them on they were so cute I got these at DSW though they were $39 $40 and I got black ones too but they're so comfy and they're perfect for the pool and just like going around but yeah 
just want to show you guys that um i hope you guys enjoyed the video please let me know if there's something else you want to see i am i think in the next video i'm going to show you guys my scale that i weigh myself on because it does have an app to it and it shows like a whole bunch of stuff like your body fat water weight all that so i'll show you guys that next time um but thank you for your support and i will see you guys later bye